This adorable little guy behind me could be the answer to our pesticide problems. That's right. Ants may be a cheap, effective alternative to chemical pesticides. Now, while many people consider ants to be pests themselves, a study that came out in the Journal of Applied Ecology says that ants are the best documented example of biological control on open farms. And their efficiency, in fact, rivals conventional chemical pesticides and on top of that, they're cheaper too. That's right, so this is not something that just came out of nowhere. Up to 17, 000, sorry, 1,700 years ago in China, farmers bought ants to release in citrus groves. Meanwhile, in Vietnam, farmers are using weaver ants to help them grow cashews. Now, basically what we're seeing is that these weaver ants, this is a specific type of ant, Weaver ants can reduce pest numbers and the damage they cause, increasing the yield of crops, upping net income by up to 71%. Highly effective, good for the environment. We're talking about beneficial relationship here, right? And not to mention, these weaver's ants are not the only type that can do it. We are seeing that weaver ants are not the only ones uniquely qualified to do this job. They share these beneficial traits with almost 13 thousand other species of ants. According to studies, other ant species have demonstrated the potential for controlling arthropod pests, weeds, and plant diseases in orchards, forests, and farms. And guess what? Companies are getting in on it. Two European companies are now taking the step to provide weaver ants nests to farmers, and of course, a Danish aid project is trying to establish ant nurseries in Africa, providing mature colonies to affected farmers. This is a step in the right direction. This is the most exciting story I have heard this week, talking about the environment. So maybe we'll all end up with a nice colony of beneficial ants in our backyard, so we're not spraying that Roundup to get our weeds away spraying some pesticides in our garden. Just an idea. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe.